that I'm ready to, to put before the voters my campaign. And how might the campaign go? Well, we saw the first dirty trick of the race when a guy in a parrot suit paraded a dead Miami voter in front of the courthouse, offered a fistful of absentee ballots for sale, and hoisted a sign, I support Mayor Suarez. At the opposite end of the spectrum, there was the ridiculous parrot man, as he's called, announcing his candidacy for mayor today. He says he'll work for crackers. And most ridiculously, John C. Parrot declared. Number three, no more budgets. Number four, Parrot Jungle will become the official city hall. All I will say is I will not seek. At City Hall, a less subtle approach from self-anointed John Q. Parrot. With political feathers being ruffled anyway, he figured, why not jump in the fray? But I am announcing my candidacy for mayor of the city of Miami. Not only do we still not know who's in charge of the city of Miami, but it will most likely remain that way for a few more days. And I am announcing my candidacy for mayor of the city of Miami. A man in a parrot suit declares his candidacy for interim mayor of Miami. At the same time, the image of a dead man rolls up with a sign saying he voted for Xavier Suarez. A beautiful day in Miami. Un ambiente un poco circense. Ejemplo hoy en la alcaldía. Por un lado, el muerto que dice que votó por Suárez. Por otro, una cotorra que dice que ahora está postulándose. Estoy aquí no en apoyo de Carollo ni Javier, pero para anunciar mi candidatura para el alcalde de la ciudad de Miami. Y por supuesto, tomándose en serio su papel, anunciaba en rueda de prensa la nueva ubicación de la alcaldía. Per Jungle va a ser el centro de la alcaldía. Y las jaulas para los pájaros van a ser en contra de la ley.